Welcome back again for another mod tutorial for Cyberpunk 2077. This time we will look at a new mod called Radio EXT. This mod allows you to have your own radio station with your favorite music. You need to have Cyber Tweak Engine installed for this mod to work. That is the only requirement for this mod, which I have installed in a previous video. You can check that out. Now with the introduction done, let's start the tutorial. Download the Radio X mod. Open the zip file and copy the folder to the main game directory. Now, go to the Radio X folder, which is Cyberpunk 2077, bin, x64, plugins, cyber engine tweaks, mods, Radio EXT. Make a new folder inside Radio folder. You can name it anything you like. Copy the metadata to that new folder you made. Now, we need to edit the metadata. You can use Notepad Plus or the default Notepad to edit it. In Display Name, you can write the radio name, which will show up in-game on the radio list, along with the frequency. Then you write the same frequency again for FM. For icon, you can keep it as it is. You can change it but, it's not worth it to find the icon code name to change it, and, most of them would not look that good either. Unless, you want to add custom icons. For that you need to use the Cyberpunk modding tool, Wolven Kit. It requires a bit more effort but, if you want to make it look more realistic, you can do that. I will link a good guide on how to create custom icons in the description. But, as I said, for most people, you will not need them. Last thing is you can adjust the volume. I will keep the default but, you can increase it if you like. Then save it. Now, we add music. I have already downloaded three songs as an example. You need at least three songs for the mod to work, and there is no upper limit. It supports MP3, or WAV, file format, and each file needs to be less than 10 megabytes. Also, the names cannot have any special characters or gaps in them. So, we need to rename them. After that, just drop them into the folder along with the metadata. And, that's it. Now, let's check if it works in-game. it works. Now you can keep adding songs to that folder or make new one. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.